I want to welcome you back to Black Side tonight. We're going to talk about Brittany Griner's statement. It's a crime that trans women can't compete against regular women. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button. Hit that notification button. But also comment on this video. Brittany Griner made a statement at a press conference that she believes that trans women should compete with regular women. We know for many years we have had Title IX sports, which protected women in women's sports, that women should compete against women and have the opportunity to get the same kind of recognition that men would get. But in 2023, it seems like some people have lost their damn mind. And one of them is Brittany Griner. Brittany Griner, who came home from Russia, who basically was traded for the terrorists, comes back here. And she's not fighting to keep Title IX. She's basically letting men come into women's sports and compete against them. So you telling me that if LeBron James woke up tomorrow, which he wouldn't do, but I'm taking this as an example, and he said that he was a trans woman and he wanted to play in the WNBA, do you think that would be okay? Do you think a trans LeBron James will score 95 points a game, that that would be okay? And that's competition for women? When is black women, when is women in general going to stand up against this nonsense? The abnormal is trying to become normal. You telling me that a guy who played college basketball, 6'10", can't make it in the NBA, can't make it overseas, but he can say he's trans? play in the WNBA and score 50 points a game and that's okay? Brittany Griner said she will fight against those who are trying to protect Title IX sports. Women like Riley Gaines. The Republicans right now, if they don't do anything right, they're doing this right. They are protecting women and young girls all across America to have a right to compete against biological women. Women. Can you remember, uh, imagine, and you have seen in Connecticut, there was the 100 meter dash for the state championship and they had trans women in that 100 meter dash. All three of them, one, two feet, when it's finished, one, two, three, and the women finished behind them. Do you think that was fair for the girls who worked all their lives to get to that championship, having to compete with biological boys or men? But you got her. You got that clown, Megan Rapino. She's out there promoting this crap, but she's retired. Remember, she was retired from soccer. She's saying it's okay for trans women to compete against biological women. We see what happens in a UFC fight where a woman damn near got killed by a trans woman. See, this has to stop. And where's the black women standing up for black girls? This shit is out of control. There's some things that women themselves should be able to do and compete against each other. We saw that in the NCAA championship. When you saw women and you saw the LSU team compete as women. 
what we gonna start adding in men into the women's NCAA basketball championship and that's gonna be fine because you want to have a political agenda that the abnormal has become normal in America this is absolutely disturbing and it's getting out of control to me this is where it needs to stop because it's expecting millions of girls who won't be able to enjoy winning champ. Can you imagine a trans woman playing tennis with a male body? Did you remember what Serena Williams said? She said, I couldn't beat the 700th best male player in tennis. And we're talking about possibly the greatest tennis athlete of all times and probably one of the greatest female athletes of all time. She should know because she hit against them. It's a crime to separate. Well, what they need to do is get their own damn league and they can compete against each other. You talking about the strength of a man, even if it decreases 10 or 15%, he still has a man's body. This is absolutely dangerous and this needs to stop. And we need these so-called feminists these black women, these white women to stand up, but they scared as hell because they know about the alpha, alphabet community's agenda and how powerful they are. Where's all these feminists? Where's all these magazines standing up for women? Knowing that these transgender, they starting to win freaking beauty contests. Miss America, Miss this, Miss World. What kind of nonsense is this? She comes back with, from Russia and she's even crazier. Some people need to be left behind. I ain't gonna, I, I don't care about it. If you can't talk common damn sense, what the hell damn good are you? You're destroying women's sports because you want an agenda passed. I want to thank you for listening to Black Side. I hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.